Now, I guess despite that first kiss, it looks like you guys have great on-camera chemistry, which obviously sparked dating rumors. Yeah. Will you put those to rest for us? You haven't even watched the movie and they're already coming up with rumors. That's so bizarre. It's, it's people. People are going to come up with things and spread them on the internet. It's the, the scowl of the digital I think era. people are also looking for that. If you look at all the American films where they're romantic comedies and everything, and that Mr. and Mrs. Smith... Um, Everybody wants thing. Brangelina how, to happen exactly again how, and again. Exactly, how they always end up together off camera. Um, but I think people fail Twilight. to, to realise that Twilight happen often. It happens Stewart, all the yeah, time. Actually, um, not all the time. Oh. But yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't mean to be <laughs> so um, hyperbolic about that, sorry. Um, but I think people first are looking for that. They want their own local version of that. Mm. But also they, they fail to realize that, sure, we've been seen a lot together because we were together for two months. We get along really well. And we actually end up being best friends um, throughout that whole process. Like we could chat about anything. Um, we just laughed about everything. And I think uh, when you have that go-to person that you strike that relationship with, when you finish the movie, everyone goes their own ways. And you know, you've lost that family that you've built up for those two months every single day and um, we just sort of refused to let that happen I guess so yeah um, yeah she doesn't even like going on dates either so no definitely you don't like going on dates no, no. why dates are bad it's such a painful process it's like you know those people who like they like live to date I know I, I don't I, get I can it never understand I mean People who join Tinder and you're like going on like oh, 20 yeah. dates. I'm like, oh I my God, I die. I can't, I die. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, it's but always I mean, like, hi, how are you? Then I have to tell you about my life. And it's like a job like, interview. I can't do yeah. it. I can't do it. But also it. I think, um, I think people like see that match and they want that, you know? Mm -hmm. um, do but you yeah, think she's, so? she's, Do you think people want it? I think people want it. Not. You don't think so? No. A lot of girls hate me because of those rumors. A lot of guys hate me because of those really? rumors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of guys want my hair chopped off. But I mean, they honestly, she's, she's, um, she's smart. She's funny. She's caring. Who wouldn't want her? That didn't work. <laughs> that did not work. There you have it. You can catch these two in Tell Me Sweet Something hitting cinemas nationwide on September the 4th.